This is from Ida, Ida in Maysville. She says, I need to sell a modular home, and I don't know how the process is different than with a regular home. And the most times when people say a modular home, they really mean a mobile home. And um, you, you can f- buy and finance mobile homes. You can't get a Fannie Mae or a Freddie Mac loan on a mobile home, so you have to go to local banks. And by the way, if you're out there listening and you can share some additional information on this, please do, because I probably am not the one who should be answering this question on the radio. But most of the time when I go and see people who say I need to sell a modular home, it's a mobile home that has been added onto uh, or has been put on a permanent foundation. The problem is, is that a mobile home has a title like a car, and so when you're selling a property and it has a mobile home on it with a title like a car, it really is like selling a piece of property with personal property. And I'm sure you can understand why a bank would think the property was worth less if you could get into your home and drive it off the property. (laughs) Because if they're holding the property and the improvements as collateral, you have the ability to drive their collateral somewhere else. And so it's a little bit riskier for them. But if you can make it permanent, and I really need to do some research and see exactly what that means, but you can go through a process of retiring the title so first you got to put that mobile home into a situation where it's more per- permanent home, no wheels on a solid foundation. I'm sure they've, there's some rules. So you need to get the title retired so that it becomes a piece of land with an improvement that is not movable, meaning you can't move it anymore. And I went out on an appointment maybe two months ago with a lady who was a very similar situation. And this thing had a mobile home right down the middle of the of the property and it had many different additions it was a fantastic home by the way it was owned way back when by somebody who owned a sheetrock company in metro atlanta and the inside of this home mobile home and all the the expansions that have been done over the years had the best sheetrock work i have ever seen rounded corners decorative tray ceilings in all the rooms i mean it was just amazing and so here's what i have suggested for those particular people as we go through the process of retiring the title so it is a piece of land with an improvement on it because it'll change the value. And then we can compare it specifically to modular homes, homes that are brought in and pieces and put together. We can also compare it to inexpensive single family regular homes in the area and it will help get your price up. So the question was, I need to sell a modular home, don't know how the process is different than with a regular home. If it's already a modular home and the title has been retired, then you don't really need to do anything different. But I'll bet you when you refer to it as a modular home, you're probably talking about a mobile home. And in that case, you need to turn it into a piece of property with the uh, improvement.